Hello everybody, this is Ayokunle from Blooming Gardens. How are you guys doing today? All right, I'm not on the farm today, but I just want to quickly show you a video of um, a tomato plant that I have at the back of my house and how well it's doing. All right, um, so I'll just uh, show you the tomato plant now. Okay, at the back of my house here, yeah, I have some lemongrass, potatoes, uh, sweet potatoes crawling all over the place. Uh, the, my wife calls this plant, uh, never go hospital or die, hospital never come or something like that. One funny name like that. I'm sure some of you would know what this plant does. I understand it's very medicinal. If you take it regularly, no, no disease or anything comes near you. Anyway, this is the focus. Can you see this horrible looking tomato? Um, I did not plant it. It's, um, I don't know, probably some seed from somewhere just fell on the floor and it started growing. But about two weeks ago, we just would come to the back of the house and we'll see some of them like this, ripe, get ripe. We just pluck it and pluck it and just kept producing fruits. No sticking, no sprays, nothing is done to these fruits and it keeps producing, as you can see. Now, just this morning, I harvested all of this probably because the soil is not very good can you see the fruits are yeah so you can see the, the, the seeds the fruit sizes are quite small if you compare it to my hand you can see they're really small tiny and um you know i live in the lucky area so you know the kind of soil that we have here no nutrients it's just all sand so i'm not expecting a lot of things inside and i've not been feeding it no manure no fertilizer nothing just rain just rain nothing else no sprays you can see all the, the, the leaves uh the light green color shows that there is a lot of uh, nutrient deficiency most likely nitrogen magnesium calcium is all missing a lot of uh what i call it blight is this blight i don't know whatever but in short some things plenty of things are going wrong but it keeps producing it keeps producing it keeps producing i don't see new flowers anymore but all the ones that has produced okay well there's still some new flowers coming up there you know new flowers coming up there you know but it just this is all of this is just one singular plant i don't even know what variety this is you know but why am i doing this video this morning it's just like if all of this just today's harvest alone i'm able to get 200 grams because this weighs 200 grams i just scaled it on my hand scale here and all of these weighs 200 grams and i've harvested um probably like a total of maybe another four five hundred grams up until now and what i have on that plant there is still gonna easily clock 300 grams minimum so i'm saying to myself that for those of us that are now doing commercial farming why are we not clocking two kilograms, three kilograms, four or five kilograms per plant in the field? Because right there in the field, we can stick, we can provide better nutrition, we can spray against all these diseases and so many much more, so many other things that we are already doing. So why are we not clocking those four, five, six kilograms? Because think about it for tomato farming. If, uh, if you put into 10,000 plants in, an acre, in half an acre, and you are able to get even two kilograms two kilogram times ten thousand plants we're talking of 20 tons multiply 20 tons by the current market price then you're in good money so why are you not getting that good money like my answer is um well my answer to that is that um, we need to do a lot more research a lot more research has to go into what we are doing you're right. I have a crop in the field right now, which is showing, I mean, very promising, very promising. I'll probably show you, show you the video later on, but I'm so excited about what we're doing right now. Anyway, we're not talking about the field today. That's the video I wanted to share with you. Um, we need to do a lot more research, a lot more learning a lot more so that we can achieve the kind of results that we want to get it's possible because this that's what this plant tells me now that it's possible to do two kilograms per plant it's possible to do five kilograms per plant hi Neto, how are you it's possible to do two kilograms per plant it's possible to do five kilograms per plant if we get our acts right and that's what we need to do all right so 
this is me ayokule signing out if you like this video please click the subscribe button and press the notification bell guess what it's free just click on it click on it and you'll be, you'll be better for it all right i'll see you on my next video bye